What's happening, guys? My name is gt 5 man 21 or Josie Wells, because I'm uploading this on both channels. And this is, uh, once again, some F1 2013 news, but it's news that they have confirmed the other two classic drivers. Yes, they have confirmed the driver for the Ferrari 90 F92A and the Williams FW21. And I am going to be revealing them right now. So, anyway, guys. Here are the drivers, and uh, yeah, how this is going to work, there is going to be a picture of the car, and I'm going to tell you who it is. So anyway, guys, let's get on to the first car. First of all, guys, all credit goes to Team VVV for the information. He got the information from the gameplay he played on of a classic 90s race. That was the first time someone got gameplay of that and the first official gameplay of Estrel and I noticed that the two dri two drivers that they had confirmed as well for the F92A the Ferrari that is and the Williams F321 um, I know that because I spotted it so here we go so the first car is actually the Ferrari F92A now we already know that the original driver is Jean Alesi However, people were saying it's going to be a team legend who's going to drive that. But actually, it isn't. Because I can tell you now, it is actually an original driver who drove for the team. Now, they, at this point, they had a choice because they, they alternated two drivers in that year. They had a choice of either Ivan Capelli or Nicola Larini. And I can tell you now that the driver... the the driver who will also partner Jean Alesi in the F92A, the Ferrari F92A, is Ivan Capelli. Yes, Ivan Capelli is going to be partnering Jean Alesi in the Ferrari F92A. And how do I know that? Here's the proof. So here is the proof, guys. As you can see, it there is Team VVV that right there, lot driving in Jean Alesi's F92A. But actually, that's not important because look at the name below Alesi. It says Capelli. Now, Capelli, I know Capelli would be in a Ferrari because Capelli has never drove for a Williams. And plus that, he wasn't even the original driver for the F. W21. Why would he be? So I can tell that he's actually the Ferrari driver because he actually drove for Ferrari and never Williams. So there's the proof, guys. Now let's go to the next car. So here's the next car, guys. And as you can see, it is the Williams FW21. Now we they we know that their legend driver is Alan Prost. However, they did not confirm their original driver. I can tell you it is actually an original driver. There's it isn't a legend driver as well. It is an original driver. So really then, they had a choice of either Ralph Schumacher or Alessandro Sonardi. <clears throat> and I can tell you now that the driver who is going to partner Alan Prost in the Williams FW21 is Ralph Schumacher. Ralph is going to be on F1 2013 with Alan Prost. How I know that? Here is the proof. So there's the proof, guys. As you can see, Team VVV has set off, has taken off the start with Jean Lazy, but the name below. If you can see the name below a lazy is Schumacher. Now that could be Michael Schumacher. However, now you might think for a minute, guys, that that is Michael Schumacher actually. But I can tell you that it is actually Ralph. Because here is the next picture, some more proof. So here is some more proof, guys. And as you can see, there is Michael Schumacher in the Ferrari F310 from 1996. So that obviously proves that Michael's near the front and Ralph's at the back. How I know that? Because Ralph actually didn't overtake... That Schumacher didn't even overtake a lazy. A lazy just got up to fifth and, and got near the Michael. So that obviously proves that Ralph Schumacher is in a Williams FW21. Um, how I know that? Because Ralph actually never even drove for a, Willi for a Ferrari. He only drove for, if I quote, uh, Jordan, Williams and Toyota. They are the only teams he went to before he moved to DTM. 
So yeah guys, that is the proof for you. Uh, tell me in the comments what you think about the two drivers, Ivan Capelli in the Ferrari F92A and Ralph Schumacher in the, F in the Williams FW21. Do you like the choices? And if so, tell me guys what car are you looking forward to driving and what driver are you looking forward to be. Um, now before I go guys, in the description there is a list of the classic 80s and classic 90s uh, cars and drivers. But for those of you who don't want to look in the description, I'll tell you anyway. So, here are the drivers and teams again, guys. So, let's start off with the classic 80s. So, in the Williams Ford FW07B from 1980, we have Alan Jones and Alan Prost. In the Lotus Renault 98T from 1986, we have Mario Andretti and Emerson Fittipaldi. In the Lotus uh, Honda 100T from 1988, we have Satoru Nakajima and Mika Hakkinen. In the Williams Jordan FW12 from 1988, we have Nigel Mansell and Damon Hill. And in the Ferrari F1-87-88C from 1988, we have Gerhard Berger and Michael Schumacher. Now on to the classic 90s. Um, in the Williams FW14B from 1992, sorry, the Williams Renault uh, FW14B from 1992, we have Nigel Mansell and David Coulthard. In the Ferrari F92A from 1992, that we have Jean Alesi and Ivan Capelli. In the in the Ferrari F310 from 1996, we have Michael Schumacher and Gerhard Berger. In the Williams Renault FW18 from 1996, we have Damon Hill and Jacques Villeneuve. Um, in the in the Ferrari F399 from 1999, we have Eddie Irvine and Jody Schechter. And finally, in the Williams Supertech FW21 from 1999. We have Ralph Schumacher and Alain Prost, the Ferrari F1999 from 1999, if you're wondering. Uh, I can't remember if I said 1999 there. Um, so anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, yeah, I'll hopefully speak to you soon. Take care.